Yeah, good morning, guys. And uh, most of the activity is going to be happening right here at the Salt Palace, the convention center. Uh, grounds will be transformed into various sports courts for a whole variety of events. And other things like bowling will be in other locations in the Salt Lake Valley. It's going to be a, a very big event. And we caught up with one veteran, Timothy Fagan, who served nearly four decades with the military, you know, primarily with the Utah National Guard. He says the sports programs offered by the VA here in Salt Lake, essentially a lifesaver for him. Tim Fagan knows firsthand that adjusting to the rhythm of civilian life can be a big challenge for many military veterans. You're not on the same tempo like you are during your military service. You're maybe at a loss trying to find your place. Beginning in the late 1970s, Fagan spent nearly four decades at various outposts and in different assignments all over the world. Panama, uh, Afghanistan. I also trained soldiers going to Iraq and Afghanistan, so I did four tours in support of the war. Fagan says the adaptive sports program and the therapists here at the VA in Salt Lake City were a huge help in regaining his civilian equilibrium. It's my goal to work with veterans. Um, I want to give back to those who have served for the country. Shannon is not a veteran, but says she has several family members who have served. She says it is especially gratifying to see veterans like Tim Fagan readjust after their military service and says sport can be a big part of that. Overall, it helps build up their self-esteem, help them learn coping skills, also getting not only just their themselves, but their whole family. Because at the end of the day, it's not just the veteran that needs to learn how to adapt to the world, it's their whole core team there, because it's a holistic approach. Fellow veterans, it gives you a, a, an opportunity to let your guard down a little bit. You can be, a, be around guys you trust, guys you uh, have shared the same experiences like you have. And there will be at least 60 local veterans involved uh, in these upcoming Golden Age games, the Wasatch Warriors. There are still a few spots open, so any veterans out there who are interested, uh, there'll be uh, an ability to sign up online beginning tomorrow. And we'll have a link uh, posted for how to do that on our website, fox13now.com. For now, we're live in Salt Lake City. Scott McCain, Fox 13 News, Utah.